it's always a huge honor to compete against Hanyu, and he's pushed me, he's pushed the sport so, so much. He's two-time Olympic champion, like, that's amazing, so. He has a way of owning the stage like certain rock stars do. Absolutely extraordinary. And that is why he's the Olympic champion, one of the greatest figure skaters of all time. And you gave every ounce of everything he had, but Nathan Chen has come out here and he has taken it to another level. He has just blown this out of the park. Look at that, 224.92. Witnessing history here, Nathan Chen. Yuzuru, while competing in his third event that month, he finished second. To be able to have the honor to compete against him and well, compete with him, not even against him, but, um, is just, you know, a dream come true for me. Respect to him, because um, he has wonderful jumps and you know, wonderful access for the jumps, and you know, like, um, he can you can pray for like, you know, like, um, with a memory. Like, it's like, it's like really feeling good and kind of watching him. And Nathan, you were saying, yeah, it's always a good opportunity to skate with Yuzu, and Yuzu, you said basically the same. Can you tell me why it's so nice to be skating on the same ice together and to compete against one another? Um, I mean, Yuzu's like the GOAT, like he's the greatest of all time, really. Um, one of the best to ever step on the ice, so to have this opportunity to be able to share the ice with a guy like that, um, someone that I've looked up to for a long time, um, someone that I've watched grow up through the junior ranks when I was a, like a baby, um, it's really cool to be able to see him now, and um, you know, it's it's really cool to even just be able to see him in person. Um, so, of course, having an opportunity to finally be able to compete against him, and you know, have you know, someone who's constantly like in the distance that I'm trying to catch is. Really これやっぱり強い相手と戦うのがすごい好きで、やっぱ隣にいる。一人だけを見てくれるということがあんまりないかなって思いますし、あとは何か表現したいことを表現するっていうことができないかなって思うんですよね。だからフィギュアスケートはすごく特別だなって思うし、フィギュアスケートがすごく好きだなって思います。um, I have a question for Nathan and Yuzuru. Uh, you're doing five quad in the free, but four different ones. And uh, I would like to know then if Yuzuru, you were trying to do the quad flip and um, Nathan the quad loop, and if you are ready to give each other the advice on your missing quad. I mean, I'm waiting for him to do quad axle. <laughs> we'll see what happens there. Um, man, yeah, quad loop is scary, you know. Props to him for trying that. Um, I've done it in the past, but it's it's just a scary jump. Like, just going back, like, Obviously, Sao is also a clean edge jump, but um, the fact that you're so off axis on loop just really scares me, and I'm like so afraid of like hitting the boot. So generally, I don't really like loop; it's not my favorite jump. Um, and so, as of now, I'll let him take care of that, and you guys can watch him do quad loop if you guys want to watch. But, um, but yeah, I mean, you know, he truly has everything. So like, what can, what advice can I really give? <laughs> I really want to win to him because I very really respect to him. Ever and no one has ever been able to skate at that level in the history of the sport. He's definitely pushed the sport, pushed me so, so much. Um, and uh, it's, it's just a huge honor to be able to compete with him and you know skate after him. It brings so much excitement to the crowd and uh, it's just an awesome experience. Of course I had, I had so much pressure, pressure for skating, but I really love to skate. I really love to perform. I want to skate with my fans. I'm never feeling like Champion. I'm always challenger. Tokuninanimo,いつものシーズンと変わらなくて、えっと、まあチャレンジャーっていうことを言われますけど、でもいつも他のスケーターのいいところを追いかけてるし、他のスケーターに対してチャレンジしたいなって思ってるし、だからい
here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's in here. It's just, it's just here. <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm his fan. <laughs> Thank you, my friend. Thank you. 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 Thank you.